I'm delighted to announce that the winner of the 2013 Telstra Northern Territory Businesswoman of the Year is Helen Summers. Ladies and gentlemen, distinguished, distinguished guests, thank you. It's just amazing and very humbling to be here as the 2013 Telstra Business Women winner. <laughs> Thank you to my family and my friends, my fantastic team at work, my supporters here tonight, everybody who I've met, the opti uh, optometry scene of Australia for their support, the directors of Guide Dogs of iCare Plus and the Australian Optometric Panel and the Indigenous Working Group from the Australian Optometric Association. <laughs> I'd just like to go back where I, I started as a graduate in Africa. When I was working with, I was working with artificial eyes and these people were coming from Sudan and Ethiopia into Nairobi and we were, we were giving them artificial eyes because the witch doctor had hashed it up. We weren't actually making an improvement to their vision but they still felt we were making a difference to their lives. And I think that was a really strong experience that, it brought, that changed my career because before that I was quite a disillusioned optometry graduate. So coming to Darwin has given me these opportunities to create my career, to uh, live the passion of making a difference to others and I thank the people in the small regional communities and the people of Darwin for supporting me on this journey and just for making everything possible. So what do these awards really mean? We've just got to use this simply to better women, to empower women, locally, nationally and globally. On a local level, it's just mentor, 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 motivate, inspire our young women. Let's make sure they have dreams and they can follow their dreams and they can celebrate their enthusiasm. On a national level, we have 500 ASX companies and only 16% are female directors and only 12 female CEOs. The Discrimination Act was set in 1984 and 30 years later we still have inequality of female graduates in remuneration and, and experienced women. Let's make sure our daughters have the same opportunities as our sons. And on a global level, there's many women who don't have the same opportunities as us. We really need to make sure that we can strive towards the global goals of reducing illiteracy, improving health conditions and reducing discrimination. Well, not reducing discrimination, let's abolish discrimination. So. What you get out of life is what you have the courage to ask for. And as we said before, let's just follow your dreams, be proud, be seen, be heard, celebrate yourself, be yourself. And as Tina Turner said, let's just celebrate just simply the best. <laughs> Thank you.